To start recording, you should press the plus button in the bottom right corner. First of all, select a name for the new measurement and accept. Recording will be activated automatically. A recording box will appear on the app's screen, indicating that the unit is measuring. While recording, the app allows you to view the historical records on screen. To do this, select a measurement and scroll the screen to the left. The app has five screens. The first screen contains the main parameters, giving you an overview of the installation. On the second screen, you can see any recorded value in graphic form. Remember that the filtering option is at the top right. This allows you to display any parameter that you want on screen. On the third screen, you can view the harmonic decomposition graph, if the installation has harmonics. On the fourth screen, you can view the installation's voltage or current wave shape, both single phase and three phase. Finally, on the fifth screen, you can view the quality events log. The unit records any type of event that the installation may have experienced with the time and date. To manage the records, at the bottom of the main screen there is an edit option next to each measurement on the right. This allows you to delete or share the record as well as view the alarms log and the measurement configuration. When you enter the measurement configuration, you access the report made on the record. This allows you to know how the measurement was configured, thus enabling you to ensure that the parameterization is correct. For example, it allows you to know the parameterization of quality events, the voltage and current phase sequences, the transformation ratio of the clamps, and the state of the unit's inputs. You can also see how the granularity of each parameter measured with My eBox is configured. If you want to send the data to the cloud or share the information, you should press Share and then select the granularity with which you want to share the measurement. You can also choose the quality events. Once you have sent the file to the cloud, you can delete the record log if you wish.